Hey guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. So I ordered some cards from uh, Troll and Toad and Yu-Gi-Oh Mint. Both packages arrived at the same time. And I'm going to do a little unwrapping or unboxing of the cards that I ordered. I think they are pretty good. I know what the cards are, but you guys don't know. So I'm sure that you guys are pretty excited to find out what I ordered. So one thing I like about Yu-Gi-Oh Mint is that when you order cards, you get sleeves with them, so this is Yu-Gi-Oh Mint. Um, Troll and Toad don't, doesn't do that, but it's fine. They do ship the um, items uh, good, in good condition. So this one is already open, so we're gonna start off with Troll and Toad. So this set of cards is primarily for my Six Samurais. I ordered some cards to try to make the deck a little bit more viable in the current meta, try to make it more competitive. So we're gonna go through the cards. The first card that you see, you can see that it is a six samurai card. Let me zoom in a little so you guys can you know, see what's going on. So yeah, we get a little plastic protective thing. It's a very sturdy piece of plastic. And then the cards are in another piece of plastic to you know prevent other stuff from damaging them. So let's focus in. So we have my six strike, two of them. Shin, I've always wanted a second one. Cunning of the Six Samurai. Uh, Wicked Knight. Instant Fusion to summon my Wicked Knight to give me an extra warrior monster to link off. Magatama, just for the sake of having it. This is for a friend of mine. Um, these two cards, these three cards, are for a friend of mine with a Marine Cess deck. So these aren't mine. And then this is for another friend of mine. He has a uh, crystal beast deck. So he has three of those. So yeah. And this is for another friend of mine. Um, he has a lot of decks. So yeah. We have a hero calls. This allows me to special summon a monster from my graveyard or my hand. So that's pretty cool. A warrior monster. So it's a part of my six samurai. This looks pretty cool. And it's very cheap. So I, I bought it. Um, double edge. Don't know why I bought that one. I bought two of um, the fire guy, you know, girl with the combo, the unlimited counter combo. So I got two of her. Uh, Secret of the Six, pretty good card. I got Ready Fusion. I got Cross Sheep. This is for the guy with the decks, you know, a lot of decks. This card was pretty expensive. I, I paid four dollars for it, so. Mm. It allows me to special summon. This card is pretty cool. This is going to allow me to get to my FTK monster, uh, Amazonist Warrior, real quickly. Because it's ability, let me see if I can show you guys what it does. Pretty much, it. the number 3 said add a level 4 or, add a level 4 monster from your deck to your hand. So that's pretty awesome. So if I link off with my monsters, I'll be able to add a level 4 monsters monster so I'll just add the Amazon warrior and then summon Saruja and Saruja would allow me to summon into the field and you know go for a game I have this guy um, Millennium I restrict pretty cool card this can allow me to um, stop Ash uh, effect Valor any card effect that activate monster effect that activates I can equip the card from the graveyard or the field to this card and negate the effect of the card so this is pretty broken this is for the marine test guy as well and then this card is going to help me to pull off my combos because it allows me to detach two and i can special summon a monster from my graveyard so that's it for the cards that i ordered from um troll and toad now let's move on to the ones that i got from Yu-Gi-Oh mint i'm pretty much more excited about the cards from Yu-Gi-Oh mint because i got some pretty cool cards from the new the new release, the new reprints. So yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty excited. So let's go ahead and unbox this. You can see we have this is well wrapped. I mean, we got one of this in Troll and Toad, but for Yu-Gi-Oh Mint, we got roller bands. We got everything. Is pa wait? Why didn't I get any sleeves? I thought they gave sleeves with all the cards. Th that is, that is not cool. Alright, so we got it in a little wrapper. 
Um, I mean, it's fine, but I thought we were getting 71 sleeves. So yeah, let's take a look at the cards that I got from um, Yu-Gi-Oh! Mint. Oh, this card is pretty. All right, so I think it's thick. All right, so we're gonna start at the top. This deck for these cards, it cost literally seven dollars for the entire archetype for these cards, so I just decided to get them. So we got three of this, three of this, three of these, three, 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 three. I got three of all of the appliances cards. And I got a secret terraforming. Pretty, pretty. Some more appliances cards. Alright, so this is all the appliances stuff. Now we get into the good stuff. So we have Magistus Fiend. This is going to be a part of my stun. Uh, stun. Uh, runic. Yeah, so my stun runic. So I got three Magistus Fiend. This is a part of my um, Natura runic, and this is a part of my Invoke runic. So I got one more M pen for my main deck. So I got one more Flounderies and Advent of Adventure, and one more M pen to complete my deck in terms of all the archetypes. Spellbone is a very broken card. You guys should definitely get Spellbone. We have some more Natura cards. I, I got them all in secret. Uh, I mean super because they reprinted so I had to get them and now for the good stuff you have some runic cards that's your blessing runic fountain runic tip pretty pretty okay, let's focus runic tip and other, some runic cards the slum I don't know why I have four slumbers and we have two runic wing which is pretty solid so that's it for all the cards that I got so far. I will be having a lot more deck profiles to show you guys, especially the runing stuff and my six samurais, and also the appliance stuff. So if you want to see that, so yeah, thank you guys for watching and stick around for more. What did I order?